Ever since I was younger, I was into video games. Somebody like the views so I can bring bad news to all these crews who can't NBA jam. What's going on, guys? Welcome back to another beer review. Uh, look at us being back out in the garage. It's kind of a weird, dreary day today, so being outside wasn't going to be that great. So we're back in the garage. Hopefully, I haven't been out here in a long time. Hopefully, the audio and everything looks and sounds okay. If not, it is what it is. But uh, another new brewery today on the channel. Uh, Triptych, I think is how you say this. They are out of Savoy, Illinois. Um, this is <laughs> Dank Meme, and that can art is awesome. Uh, big thanks to my man Michael for sending this one. Um, this is a pale ale. It is, what's the ABV on this? Does it say? Does it not say? Come on. Wow. <laughs> it does not say what the ABV is. That's disappointing. This is probably, I don't know, 6%? I'm not sure. Why doesn't it say it? It says the IBU, the malts. It says there's malt, oat, uh, wheat. It has all the hops and the IBUs, but it doesn't have the ABV. Are you, are you serious? That's weak. Wow. I don't know what the ABV is. Like 55 to 6% maybe? Who knows? Um, 60 IBU pale ale, it says. Pale malt, oats, and wheat. El Dorado, Azaka, and Citra hops. Um, this was canned on June 22nd, so we're a little bit of hashtag Team Old IPA today. It's about six weeks old. Uh, Michael sent this a few weeks back. Um, and I just was traveling and a bunch of stuff was going on, so I didn't get a chance to get to it. But um, when I did post this photo on Instagram, people were like, ooh, that's an awesome beer. So very much looking forward to this one. And like you guys know, six weeks is not old for a beer. We like our beers with some age on them. Hopefully you guys can see that. It's been a while since we've been out here. So um, that looks absolutely freaking beautiful in the glass. It looks like pineapple juice orange juice, uh, a solid half a finger, bright white head, really, really kind of fluffy. It looks killer. It looks like that New England style. So let's go ahead and shove our nose in this one. It's called Dank Meme. Hopefully it's dank. It's not. It's straight juice. <laughs> oh, wow. That smells really good. It's like freaking orange and pineapple juice. Wow. I was hoping it was going to have like some sort of like dank kind of West Coast aspect to it since it's called dank meme, but nope. It is like, I honestly, I wish there was like something else I could say I was smelling. It smells like orange juice. Even with like six to seven weeks on it almost, there's no, it's not malty at all. This is crazy. Actually, as it's warming a little bit in my hand, it's not dank, but it's got like this herbal kind of green grassy thing. It might even be like a floral, almost piney thing. I think there is a little bit of like floral thing in there. I haven't smelled floral in a while in an IPA, and Lord knows all we drink is IPA. So this is kind of a cool, like, welcome change. Yeah, it's definitely like a floral thing, but it's straight orange and pineapple juice. Fuck, that smells good. So let's go ahead and taste it. Michael, cheers. Thank you, sir. That is real nice. Um, I will say much more aromatic than it is flavorful, and I'm guessing that the hops have faded a little bit on this one, but this is delicious. This is super light and crazy easy drinking. Um, honestly, I have no idea what the ABV is. If this is over 5%, I will be very, very impressed because it is super, super light. Um, taste falls in nose. It's orange pineapple juice, um, and there is. There's this killer, like, mid palate finish there's this awesome like floral kind of green like herbal note um a mouthfeel it's light this is really really light like if you gave this to me blind i mean <laughs> it almost drinks like think of like drinking the mouthfeel wise like drinking a lager it's really really light it's a crusher though wow really good tons of orange um lots of citrus but it's just so soft all the way across your palate. There's nothing biting about it. There's no like bitterness. Um, like I said, there's no, even like I said, with some age on it, it's not malty at all. There is just like a faint hint of like this kind of, it is, it's floral kind of herbal grassiness. Like kind of middle of your tongue to, to uh, the finish, but it's orange pineapple juice throughout. That's really, really good. Very easy drinking. I bet this would have been even more explosive a couple weeks ago um, when I got it, but it is what it is. What can you do? Lots of beer review, not a lot of time, but um, 
this is awesome world-class stuff for me like 95 96 really really good stuff awesome first impression from these guys I don't know what else they do so if there's any other beers that I need to be seeking out you guys can leave comments and let me know so yeah that's dank meme I'm gonna go 96 on this one really really good stuff Pale malt, oh tweets. Yeah, I can't believe there's no ABV. Put the ABV on your cans, poor favor, just so we know what the hell we're drinking. <laughs> this is a funny little thing on the can, but yeah, uh, I digress. I'm out of here, guys. Like I said, if you guys had it, leave a comment below. Let me know what you thought of it. Uh, and as always, thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys very soon. Cheers. Ever since I was younger, I was into video games. Somebody like the fuse so I can bring bad news to all these crews who can't NBA jam with the shoes.